Welcome to This Is Important, a production of iHeartRadio, the show where we only talk about what is most obviously very crucially important. Today on This Is Important... My butthole's pretty loose butthole from your dad. My nipples have zero firmness to them whatsoever. I cut my dick off and I'm growing it into another human. And if you're listening at home, I'm fucking the air. Let's go. Yeah, man. Wow. And the worst flavor goes out to... Wow. The milk chocolate buzz yeah, ball that, one's that you rough. all just we- drank. <laughs> What is it? This is a chocolate one? We we have not had this one on the road yet, and uh, I'm going to have diarrhea for sure. It's chocolate? It's the chocolate one? Holy shit. That is like poison milk, and I love it. (laughs) Weirdly, it got held up like in, we had like a buzz ball shipment. Mm -hmm. uh, As we do. sent, and uh, it got held up, so they went to the local liquor store or whatever you guys have here, and (laughs) got... Buzz balls, and you only have the shittiest flavor. So that, that is our bad. That is Wait, our is, bad. Hey, yeah. point, a point of pride I see here in SLC. Chocolate, yeah. Chocolate's the worst? Like, it's the worst? It's, it's pretty rough. I, I mean, I think it has dairy in it, so. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, so, I just, we just gave everyone the cause of diarrhea. Yeah. <laughs> the cause of diarrhea. <laughs> diarrhea. It's in the little ball, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. So Fuck thanks it. for coming out, guys. What's so up? Like we really appreciate it. Yeah, cool. What's up? This is cool. Yeah, we didn't know what to expect. And then, uh, and then we, all of a sudden we s- saw the tickets being sold here, and we're like, oh, there's some freaks out here in yeah, SLC. Yeah, there are. <laughs> oh, some punks. <laughs> I knew you were out here. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. You're, all, you're always peeking behind the curtain, you freaks. Yeah. Utah's kind of a mystery like that, huh? What do you mean, dude? What I'm do you just mean? saying other states were kind of like, what does go in, on in Utah? Well, right. There's well, a lot of, yeah. mis- I think the word is a misnomers. Misno- mm. uh-huh. Misnomers. You know what? Mm. Adam, think- that word is so good. Yes, points. Thank you. Got points. points for I like, I like now we're, we're not even giving oh. points to like a funny or clever joke. It's just knowing words. Yeah. 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 Vocabulary, Vocabulary have, points? Vocab points? Yeah. I might have misused it. Well, because what do you think it means? What I think a misnomer means is is you think it's one thing, and then it, like a and, and then, it's, then it's not that thing. Like so I've been hey, saying that there's right not to me. alcohol actually alcohol here, and yeah. we just went to dinner, and I'm and, drunk as fuck. And there was alcohol. Uh, and there was alcohol. <laughs> no, I'm, no, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm moderately intoxicated, but but there is real alcohol out, out here. I can taste it. Nice. <laughs> Well, I, don't, I don't. Well, you know, because because I, I feel when did they change that? I felt like when I was a kid, I grew up in Nebraska, and you always heard that in Utah, it was like five set or whatever they called it. Uh, what? Like, what do you mean? Like it's a dry state? It wasn't dry, but it was a less less alcohol. Yeah, like what? Utah. What is he looking for? Jesus. Three three percent. <laughs> Utah two. Utah. 3.2. Three. That's a tinier amount. 3.2. <laughs> oh, so 3. Point, so is that, uh, sorry, is that, so 3.2% alcohol by content or whatever is what the so limit that's, is? That's like a beer, right? Yeah. Sure. So 3.2, normally a beer is like 5. 5. I don't, 7? 5. 8? I don't know if that's true. I it's feel science. like that's a. I feel like that's pretty high for a beer. But those ones, what does that say on the can? You can figure it, it says, out right there on the can. Hang out, you guys. Just give us five minutes here. We're yeah, gonna read a can. Just give us five to ten minutes. <laughs> just We're like, like well, you're not check supposed this to out. Should we turn the Paul Simon back on while we just read yeah, these cans real quick? It seems like these cans are full of misnomers. Yeah, we <laughs> yeah. can't find huh. the number. It's a bagel. <laughs> misnumbers. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> hey, hey, all right. Hey. Yes, points. Oh, misnumbers. Okay. Boom. I hurt my shoulder. So now, now I know that you guys party. There's yeah. booze here. And then also, tons of beautiful people here, too. Okay. Gorgeous. You guys yeah. are gorgeous. Not gorgeous people. Not you guys, necessarily. Right. Oh, right. We yeah, covered not that. Not you guys. I feel like our fans 
Skew homely. But... Skew homely. <laughs> and that's fine. That's how we like them. You take after us. You're like, we're regular people. <laughs> I'm just an average guy. <laughs> A lot of Arby's coupons in the wallet. Yeah. Uh, they got the meats. But, but, dude, I was watching, like, the local Relax. news earlier in the hotel. And Sex there's pots. some... There's some 50-year-old super babes out there. Love it. All, bl- all blonde, silver blonde hair, silver blondish. It's really? got to be the mountains, right? It's got to be the mountains that surround us. Hey. Got, it's got to be. It's got to be the mountains. They're the mountains, all right, if you know what I'm talking about. Your oh. boots are huge. <laughs> Adam, I, are you here? I don't. Mountains? Uh, you want me to ex- expand? Yeah. yeah, expand, please yeah. expand. <laughs> Wait, just, they're in the mountains <laughs> all ahead. right, and then you nodded. Well, you were talking about like the weather. Oh, their tits are like. <laughs> yeah, he said. Like, should I, should, he should I have said she had? She's got great weather balloons. <laughs> well, I didn't say yes, like the, okay. the women That's here have good. huge tits. I said the <laughs> yes, people here are, are beautiful. Well, I equate <laughs> chest size with oh, beauty. Dude. Oh, right, do sure. you? Yeah, that's why like Dolly so, Parton so is my number one. Are you? Tr- but, yeah. Are you trying to fuck me or what? If I had to fuck one of the crew, yes, I would. Titty, fuck you. Sir. That's my guy. <laughs> that's my guy. Well, that's a good question. Whoa. If we had to fuck <laughs> titty, fuck. <laughs> Or just titty fuck. <laughs> I think that's what we stumbled right. into right now. Okay. That's... Well then, well that's not even fair because we Durst has the only titties to fuck. So <laughs> what's wrong with that? So we're all I feel titty like fucking that's Durst. Fair. Okay. All right. That's awesome. <laughs> so you win. Dude. This is the one thing I won. <laughs> not really. Wait, but Durst can't titty he... fuck himself. Let's keep it real. So this is a. You don't think I can? Don't know that. No, you cannot. Turn the Paul Simon him. back on. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I, and also, I'm, this is one of the, the first true glances in this nice light that I'm seeing of your outfit because we just were out. We just went to dinner, mm-hmm. and he wasn't wearing this. Nope. And then I... Took a shit. Took a shit. <laughs> and Utah! When I came out from taking the number two... Yeah. Uh, Utah, yeah. give me two. He was fully changed. <laughs> well, I got to tell you guys, coming into... Utah. Utah. I you. Utah. Utah. I Utah. gave you a number two. It, I feel like this is one of the coziest states, mm. right? Okay. Right. So you throw on like your cozy, known maybe for their I'm gonna beautiful go people jammies. and the coz. Yeah. And huge titty the uh, weather women. I didn't say well, what's huge cozier titty, than some no. big old bland didn't dogs. Say that. I was the one who mentioned the mountains, and it was just because I thought the air is better and that makes more beautiful people. I don't know. You're I not talking about the meat like mountains. That. And then you went all crass yeah. in front of all these people. <laughs> First of all, if I know our fans, they don't want to hear crass. No, <laughs> man. Come on. They don't want to are... hear about the cause of diarrhea. Yeah. Yeah. They, they don't want to hear... hear about the size of our buttholes. <laughs> they want to hear about whether Durst they're titty tied fucking or himself. loose. <laughs> yeah, they want to hear about Durst titty fucking himself. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Well, you that's a, that's a skill, that. you know. That's not just like gross for gross's sake. That's like pretty cool. It is cool. <laughs> yeah. And there's a Admittedly. there's a wonderful yeah. visual behind that. It's yeah. not, it's like, I like an acrobatic yeah. visual in my mind. <laughs> yeah. I like to think this is a window into Durs giving like the birds and the bees speech, <laughs> and he's like, and then there's there's titty fucking and. I mean, it's just way too in depth. <laughs> I feel like that's, but I feel like that might be that's okay. So good. I feel like that might be cool to like tell your your young teenage kid just so they're not like gonna go knock somebody up right out the gate. Sure. You're like, by the oh, way, yes, there's, there's a, other there's things a thing, you can do. There's a thing called titty fucking. That's good. That's you got 12 months to do that. Yes, okay? of, yeah. I feel like that. And is, women love it. Yeah, they love it. They, <laughs> I know women, they and I don't. It. They love it. You straddle the chest. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Nothing well, that, like well, So it's not so much a birds and the bees talk. It's <laughs> a... No body weight. The titties crevasse. and the fucking... It's I a crevasse conversation. Yeah, well, like yeah. the t- that would be like a contraceptive, right? That's a titty fucking no, is a that's contraceptive. Not a, no, that's the not... The opposite of Because they're not going to fuck. <laughs> it's no, not a contraceptive. This all feels like a misnomer to me, <laughs> like, brother. <laughs> I mean, by that rationale, just like getting into an elevator... Also contraceptive. <laughs> yeah, but they're not, mm. not doing always. that type of fucking in the elevator. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> yes, but <laughs> just not fucking doesn't make something a contraceptive. True. I probably used the wrong word. I'm all good with that, bro. My Dude, you're, you're, you're being a dumbass. <laughs> yes, and you're being a total misnomer about everything. 
I but I also, I guess I don't know what contraceptive <laughs> means. <laughs> I thought that meant, like, that's a, what a condom is. And I thought, like, a receptive is she's recepting. Right. And so you're trying, to, you're trying to contra that. No, you're, you're trying, trying to, to contra the reception? Rece- you, well, yeah. You know, I, and all that reception. So you thought that the root word was contra. counter-receptive or something like but that? But it is. Isn't contra, contra means not. So shouldn't it from be... The Greek, yeah. From the Greek latoniousness. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Oh, dude, I don't fucking Please. know shit. <laughs> Like Dang, contrary, it, right? Oh. So ception. I'm thinking it should be know. conception. We the word conception. should be conception. It, it should be yeah, Kyle. <laughs> we know. Sh- okay. Shouldn't it be cock reception? <laughs> well, no, because it's uh, that no. opposite. No, <laughs> it shouldn't be. It could be. You describe what that means to you. <laughs> well, I was watching the news, <laughs> <laughs> and all of a sudden, my dick flopped out. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And that was cock, cock reception. Cock reception. Huh. Yeah, that's what, masturbation. What's going on here? I've noticed the last few shows, this has become Blake's <laughs> resting yeah. gargoyle. It's like ready to get up. I think he thinks he's part of the gargoyles cartoon. <laughs> you, is this a weird way to sit? Like, just. This is. Well, I don't I've know. been doing that. I, I will say that I've been, doing, here. I've been doing this a lot. Uh-huh. Uh huh. And it's because I'm. Uh, obese now. <laughs> right. For so you, what I'm your, trying your to do is I'm trying to tuck the gut in, lean over. Yeah. Have this, the neck out. You're tucking so it? No, yeah, yeah, I'm tucking yeah, yeah. back. Yeah. Okay. And then also, yeah. my arms are my pride and joy. Yes, they are. Oh, so you, gotta, you gotta pump these yeah. up. They're up front. Yeah. Right shoulders forward. Yeah, shoulders forward. Yeah, baby. So let's get the jacket off. Yeah, let's see that. You wanna see it? Bro? Oh, you wanna see it? What are we doing here? I'm still gonna send it. Oh the hell? shit! I'm hot. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my, he's grabbing it. Wait a second. Winding it up. Wait a second, Adam. What are the gun laws? What are the gun laws in Utah? Good question. That shit's important. What's crazy to me is that your bicep and your shoulder are like the same size. <laughs> and that's not a dig. That's a scientific observation of... It's science. Mine. <laughs> it's science. Oh, he's putting it back I on. I feel like Adam is working yeah, to a point where, on. where everything on you is the exact same size. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah I, uh, I'm freakish. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, it's and all by the, the way, same circumference, everything. Yeah. Yeah. We, we got to acknowledge the facial hair. I know, let's oh, talk about wow. this shit. Can you guys see that in I the don't balcony? Know if you can see it in the upper deck. Very shagadelic. I mean, you don't... It's those pretty chops, real. Those chops are something that I'm, I am jealous of. Well, yeah. see, the thing is, is I've always known I can uh, grow these chops, but have you ever seen a fully grown, almost 40-year-old man with a purely blonde mustache? <laughs> <laughs> right. A mustache that is thick if you get close, but from a distance, you're like, there's no, he does not have a mustache. Right? Yeah, it's not there. Do you do like lemon juice in it and then lay out in the sun? I don't do anything. I'm just very Nordic when it comes to my upper lip. Hey, nothing wrong with that. <laughs> Okie dokie. Ow. Ow. Yeah, well, lemon juice because it looks like you're a little ahead for Halloween and you're going to be the dude from Trailer Park Boys. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I could see that. I definitely look like uh, like a dad who's always trying to fix your car. <laughs> yeah, I'll take a like, look at get, it. Hey, what you got under the hood there? <laughs> right. And you're like, it's a 93 Cavalier convertible. Yeah, we're <laughs> good. See it. N- not much. Yeah. It's this, it's this old Ooh, Sebring. Is that, is that carbureted? Well, let me see. That's carbureted. Let me yeah, get you under also, there. Yeah. You also know nothing about cars? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. What do you got under there? Well, that's the, what, yeah. the engine? <laughs> yeah, what's under there? Uh, motor? What's, uh, yeah. Is that... Is this your uh, Ooh, that's car? A, that's what? a battery right there. I am pretty <laughs> now, positive. Now, what that's are those? So those are wheels. Those are <laughs> oh yeah, those are hubcaps on those wheels as yeah. well. Those are nice. I'll nice. be damned! You got some of those doors on this thing, huh? <laughs> hey, so what is this made out? This uh, metal? <laughs> yeah. Do those doors lock? Because uh, <laughs> so your uh, your tailpipes in the back. Dude, when I was a kid, I, I tried to, oh, I, had a, I had a 93, no big deal, Cavalier convertible, salvage title, 
and salvage titles <laughs> rock, yeah, dude. Salvage title, dude. And I took out a loan to buy it. <laughs> what does salvage wow. title mean? Like you got it from the police officer? That means it was destroyed in a wreck, and they cobbled it together like an automotive Frankenstein. Yes, right. it was. And that's what I drive around. There's like <laughs> exactly. Uh, and so I own this this car, and I was. I just turned 16 years old, and my buddy was like, we got to juice this thing up. I'm like, hell yeah, let's spray paint the hubcaps. We got to juice it. <laughs> and, then, and then put the, the lug nuts and paint those white to match Dude. The, the sick car. Sure. <laughs> and so we did it. We took off all the, the, the hubbies. The hubs. And so you got to take the lug nuts off. And then we ran out of spray paint. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, fuck, we need more spray paint. And then I go, I know the guy to drive us. <laughs> and we get back in the car, and then I drove it down my buddy's hill. Without the lugs? Without putting the lug nuts back on. <laughs> yeah. And a wheel popped off, and we just rolled 15 <laughs> feet down, Ooh. just with, like, sparks flying. Like, like <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think and your dad came out and is like, I think... Uh, I think a wheel fell off. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You're missing a He's wheel like, there. Uh, so, uh, You're welcome. Uh, what is this? Uh, three wheels? Now, correct that me nice. if I'm wrong, but I think you're supposed to have four. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Makes a lot of sense. Uh -huh. That could have been really bad, dude. Yeah, dude. I'm, I should be dead. You could have died. <laughs> I don't know why you're joking do you think about that, it. Is you, that your near, that's a near-death experience. Do you think that was your final destination? Ooh, it's close to Halloween. <laughs> Is Final Destination spooky. a Halloween? A very like, spooky Would episode. you call Final Destination a horror? Yes! Yeah. It, it hey, is. whoever said yes... You're a bitch. Oh, shit. <laughs> fight, 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 um, fight, fight, fight. Isn't no? Final Destination kind of just what's going to happen to all of us? Okay. Whoa. And all is right. that a horror or is it just kind but of whoa, something to know? Yeah, but that's not. No one dies in their sleep as an old person in Final Destination. But I can't. Like, that's well, going to happen to at least, like, 40% of us. Dude. Some of us might be, like, walking along a train track, and there's, like, a piece of metal right. that's jingling along, right. and then it shoots out and goes... <laughs> Full train to the face. But yeah. probably most of us will just die of lung cancer. I don't know. I walked around uh, your fair city today. I feel like a lot Small of people are going to go in a weird day. way. <laughs> Is weed legal here yet? Is weed legal? No. No. Oh, no. Damn. That's a bummer. Well, Sorry dude, about I mean, that. just booze they, was legal yeah. just like 10 years ago, they man. They just got beer. Chill out, man. Yeah. <laughs> well, I just thought it could be like, you, you know, gotta, hey, like. Hey, is uh, heroin <laughs> legal here yet? <laughs> ah, bummer. Sorry. <laughs> They're Sorry. A bummer. <laughs> oh, and, and, oh, you should do it because you should see the streets of Los Angeles. <laughs> Oh, it's so nice there right They're now. Pretty you have cool. to go. Uh, anywhere you need to go to warm your hands, there's fires everywhere. <laughs> oh, there's, they, they call them fun burn pits. They're on uh, the corner of every street. Utah! Fun little burn pit. Utah! Heater. That's cool. Hey, what, what is this one? Salt Lake City. That's some Beach Boys shit, huh? What yeah. is it? Salt Lake City. Salt Lake City. Oh, nice. When do the Beach Boys, what song is that? They're like, we're going surfing on the it's mountain. Called, it's called Salt Lake City. Was oh, it, it is? Yeah. Damn. So I, I mean, the Beach Boys were, their name is the Beach Boys. <laughs> yeah, they're the, from the What made the them beach. go, you know what? Not this, not this track. I guess yeah. we, we got to listen hey, to it. Hey, Charlie. Charlie Manson, roll with us. <laughs> Real he, quick. he was a homie? Yeah, Charlie Manson was a homie of the Beach Boys. Dude, yeah. something yeah. tells me they had a lot of fun out here, the Beach Boys. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie Manson rolled with them, and I think one of them took one of Charlie Manson's songs. Whoa, this and is kind of Halloween spooky. Yeah, I, I, think spooky this, I think this could be lore, but I think that the, like uh, one of the Wilson brothers like took a song from him, and then Luke Wilson? he got fucking pissed. <laughs> you know? So was this Luke or was this Owen? He was like, <laughs> this was who were the Cha -cha -cha. Brian and then who else? I can't remember. I think Owen, it's Luke and Owen. Owen they're Andrew. in Bottle Rocket. Right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah the West Andrew. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna look up the Salt Lake City lyrics. Okay. I if you guys, really... if you could just give us five minutes, he's gonna look this up real quick. Maybe we run the Paul Simon again. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, we can listen to it for sure. This what are you looking up? Salt what Lake are you City looking lyrics? up? Yeah, the track. It's kind of. Oh, tight. this is the Beach Boys track. <laughs> Whoa, it sounds totally different than every Beach Boy song. 
They're like, let's make the same song again, but for another place. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that seems yeah. right. They're like, what if we made the exact same song again for another place we like? Right. The little old lady from They're Salt like, Lake I watched City. the local news in Salt Lake City, and we've got to go. Guys, this is kind of Halloween spooky lyrics. Oh, what's <laughs> up, dude? All right. Fuck. This is the third verse. He's like, and in... And this town doesn't suit you. This town doesn't suit me. Let's start a new life in Salt Lake City, okay? Okay. okay. So this spooky. is where it gets a little spooky. Okay. You cry the day through. I'm dead and empty. Whoa. Oh, shit. And then it's, let's hope it's different in Salt Lake City. Oh, oh my God. Wow. Jesus. <laughs> That's Brian Wilson That's, all the way, right? Yeah, Brian Wilson dealing with some like real, yeah, real yeah. But infinite then the, sadness in his belly. But then the chords, they like he's the one that says the lyrics. He's like, I'm yeah. dying inside. <laughs> right. I want to kill myself. I want to slit my throat and bleed out in front of all my friends and family. And then the other Beach Boys are like, and the song goes like this. Ding and ding and ding and ding and ding and ding Yeah, his was just, they were just poems before he plugged them in. Do you care if we talk about like sand and surfing and then get to you mutilating yourself? You know what? We're fun in the sun and it surfs up. Then I slit my wrist the long way. I wish a shark would eat me through my stomach. And Feed me the dogs. <laughs> I want you to bleed me out and then put me in one of those burn pits. Shaka shaka. Yeah. Take a hot poker and shove it up my asshole. <laughs> da, 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 in Salt Lake City. <laughs> ba, 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 ba. Stick my head in the fire. <laughs> burn all my hair off. <laughs> Take Is this blood? your axe? Can I borrow it? Gonna chop off my head and then surf all day. Take some left-handed scissors and cut open my nutsack. Cut off my nutsack. Catch a wave fall off and never come up now. <laughs> Wouldn't never the world come up be now? better if I was dead? That's what my dad said. I'm paddling out into the storm and I'm not coming back now. <laughs> not coming back. And the, and the executives are like... Sounds great. He's yeah. like, honestly, no yeah. one listens to the lyrics. Yeah, they no just one like really the cares. <laughs> <laughs> is it going to be pretty upbeat? It is. It All is right, done. we're in. All right. It's up tempo. All right, Press let's it. get in the bus. Let's go to Salt Lake City. <laughs> <laughs> Blake, do you know what you're going to be for Halloween? Because yeah, Blake... Giving credit where credit's due goes very hard on Halloween with the costumes. Well, guys, give him, not flowers, credit. <laughs> credit. Credit. Credit where credit's due. I love Halloween. I think it's my second favorite holiday, for sure. After Arbor Great Day. Great question, Thank and I'll you. tell you at the end of the show. Oh, this no. is no, like I, I, I love Thanksgiving. I just think... Uh, I love stuffing and turkey yeah. and cranberry. So, okay, Thanksgiving's your favorite. That's yeah. my number Halloween's one. your second Halloween's favorite. Halloween's my second favorite because... Okay, let's go top 75. Top 75 <laughs> yeah. holidays. Thanksgiving, Halloween, Arbor Day, Flag Day. Really? Those are okay, three and Okay, so, four. and we got to four. Mm -hmm. uh, Great. So, what, what, why Halloween? Because I don't love Halloween. What the... Huh? Whoa. I Halloween's like... dope. Halloween hey, no, is shut fucking... Shut up! Halloween's dope, you're wrong. <laughs> Let me defend myself! Okay, no, you have the floor. That's why I don't love Halloween. I love the vibe around Halloween. Okay, okay here we but go. But I don't like getting a costume. I never do it. That's the vibe. Go ahead. But I like, I like the fall. I like Adam, the, you I like are the fall. literally, you look like a Civil War uh, general right now, and you don't like <laughs> <Right>. costumes. <laughs> right. Not so much a general. I look like uh, an enlisted man. <laughs> right. Who's just like marching. You go going first. Like, we don't want to hide in a bush. <laughs> We're just gonna march and then, okay, yeah. and then yeah. reload. We yeah. can hide. <laughs> oh boy! And the general's like, "Wait till you see the black of their eyes." You're like, "That is so fucking white. close." It's, it's the white of their eyes. Right. It's I not the black it. of the eyes. Not yeah. the black. No, and that's cool. a classic. I don't like where that mis, went. That's a classic misnomer. What do you yeah. mean? You can see, you, you can see the white of people's eyes from everywhere. No, you can't. 
I see now, so many whites of eyes. No, you don't. So questionable. No, don't you know. don't. I don't see any whites. It's just of a eyes black blob past the sixth row. They you shoot, see, shoot. I can see yours. Nobody shoot. That means I would yeah, right now. Yeah. That's some civil war shit. So Wait. I don't. I don't love Halloween <laughs> for that fact. Because okay. you don't like. Dressing, dressing up. up. I don't love the the dress up. I like going to parties. I don't necessarily love dressing up. Okay. But do you dress up for your because living. you know what? Because you gotta this. be for me. I gotta be sexy, right? <laughs> we okay. Yeah. So when I get dressed up, that's not a misnomer. It's usually a real sexy <laughs> yeah. leotard or one piece. Yeah. Sure. And then how do I piss? The one that snaps down you here? Just pull it to the side. I don't no, know. you don't. You have to tuck it up in your butt and then piss in your butt. And then oh, that's, my God. And that then that's a whole deep. thing. Yeah, no, that is actually a movement. It's, uh, kids are calling it fill in the tank. Oh, they are? Yeah. That's Gen Z. Well. Yeah, dude. Yeah, and it's, uh, it's a real problem on TikTok. <laughs> 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 There's a bunch of kids bending their dick into their own butts and pissing in them. It's another contraceptive. <laughs> dude, so the fill your tank challenge. Hey, dude, I'll so give you that yes, one. Yes, points. Oh. Ow. Chilling. So our manager, Isaac, has made... Well, he asked all of us to get on TikTok. I'm the only one that did. And I so I, I just got a TikTok, and don't, you don't have to follow me. It sucks. And <laughs> so I've been on TikTok trying to look to see what I could do. My favorite is those, like, kids that comb all their hair forward and then do this move. <laughs> oh, yeah. What? And then just go, like. So sexy. <laughs> and there's, like, six shirtless dudes behind them all going, Goodbye. They're all of their supportive bros, just but like, like you they, got this, dude. Go be sexy. But I love how supportive they must Gen be fucking, Z is. Right? They must be. It must work. Those it guys, works. it works. They're titty know. fucking for they, sure. They're definitely <laughs> filling the tank. Well, in okay. high school, guys like that are are the ones titty fucking. And yeah. guys that look like us are going. What are titties? <laughs> but like, are they mountains? <laughs> I've, I've heard they're like the mountains. Same as mountains what, what, mommy. What, what, what would have been the equivalent in the 90s yeah, uh, yeah, hell to like yeah. getting your dudes together to Dude, do one of these videos? There's no equivalent to that. But, there, but, what's, but, like, but I think the equivalent of the something. same type of dude is like the Abercrombie guy. Okay. Like my, a guy I knew in high school, <laughs> Caleb. What's up, Caleb? Hello! He was an Abercrombie bro. And he was stood outside the mall, in the mall. So that was his shirtless, job. Yeah, 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 yeah. With his pants down to his top dick. And girls like, he's the sexiest man alive. Right, right. <laughs> and I, that's the same guy is now is doing that, that cool like, But that's dancing? like a job. Is it dancing? I'm saying like, like break, socially. Like, like what, this is a mating call. What was the <laughs> '90s mating call? Like breakdancing, right? Or like <laughs> it probably was breakdancing. It was like what? carrying what linoleum somewhere and then being like, "I could do the splits." <laughs> yeah, popping and locking and shit, and then everybody like, "Yo, you stick. no." What? <laughs> no. Did you grow well, up in like 1982 be? Harlem? <laughs> well, I'm thinking because obviously when boy bands showed up, then it became like supportive bros, and now You're we have what we have heart. now. Like, sure. I feel like that started it, and that's in what, the late you 90s? You are <laughs> my fire, okay. the my one desire, believe. I don't know the rest. When I say I want it that way. Wow, guys. <laughs> Shut up, bitch. Whoa, I just got fucking chills, Dude. dog. <laughs> we, we've been singing a lot, bro. Yeah, really wait, good. why did you guys just fucking do that? <laughs> what, when he, I don't know. I don't know. I just locked eyes with Kyle, and it felt right. Yeah. It's... And I think that's that's who Durs was trying to take. It was guys that would honestly sing Backstreet Boys lyrics I just to wanna, each other at parties. <laughs> just want to move on. Um, Maybe, but yeah. real quick, and then, I'll, and then I'll dive deep into Gaza. Um <laughs> Oh, we'll get there. I'll get real deep yeah. dive. Real deep <laughs> yes. dive. Because I have, cause I have a We're take. I got this weird it. take that no one has. Uh, You're fucking ba- disaster, my Backstreet guy. or NSYNC? NSYNC. I think it's, I think it's NSYNC. Well, I think NSYNC won the battle, but you saw the emotional connectivity. Right. When I looked into Kyle's eyes, yeah. and he's, he's the guy that kind of looks like a wolf. And right. I'm the guy that combed all of his hair forward. That was super hard. So okay. wait, what? What's up? In the Backstreet Boys. Oh, yeah. You're the one that sort of looks like the wolf. And I'm the one that combed all of his hair forward. And it was kind of, it was really hard looking. Right. Sure. Yeah. And then Blake is the blonde one who's like 
Aaron, Bryce? Card- Aaron I, Carter's I wanna brother. I want to say his name is Bryce. No, he's, he's the Carter's super brother. young one, right? <laughs> the youngest one who like probably shouldn't be there. You're the Joey McIntyre <laughs> type. Thank yeah. you. I'm the pervert manager. Yeah, you're who's the like, right. just show your thighs. <laughs> Get your legs out, boys. Yeah, dude. You're guys, for sure the pervy manager. Guys, I. I hate to announce, but my airdrops are open again, and I'm getting some weird <laughs> shit. <laughs> so, I forget any, where any. we were, like Indianapolis or something. <laughs> and it was Colum- Columbus. Dude, oh, was it Columbus? I don't know. I, when is this Kevin James fucking... <laughs> 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 when is it going to stop? It's, I, it's still hilarious. So Blake's, Blake's, yeah, Blake's. I don't know if you guys are here, but people are just airdropping Blake constantly, and now it's gonna get way worse. This is Ke- this is Kevin James with some Utah mountains on him. That's Kevin James? No. Yeah. It's his. I can't see it. Dude, yeah. this is. I can't hot. see the whites of his eyes. I love how you can't see it, but he turns it to all of these people. Well, that's I don't understand. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you're blind. I'm not. Yeah. 2020 vision right here. Okay. Incredible. <laughs> so don't call me blind ever again in front of people. Whoa, yeah. dude. Seems like you. Well, uh, we've covered this in previous weeks, but Kyle wore yeah. the thickest glasses since I knew him for the last 20 years. And then just like three years ago, he took his glasses off and he's like, I can actually see perfectly. <laughs> what a trash. Yeah, but let me, you know what? It's, it's fading again. I know. What? <laughs> Wait. Wait. <ooh. laughs> You're losing your sight? I think I might need to wear some reading glasses. I'm going to go check it out. I think well, that's just because we're getting old, homie. It's just from long term, long, long, when I read for a long, long time. <laughs> which, which we can tell you don't do that a lot. I know. Yeah. <laughs> when Woof. I read, when Seven I read minutes. Woof. for a lo- <laughs> long time. Sure. And they get tired. Yes. <laughs> your eyes get tired? Man, yeah. wow. And, okay. Well, <laughs> yeah. Huh. I remember when my parents got to, or when my dad had to get glasses, I cried. <laughs> Why? Because I was like, important. you're what blind, dude. You're blind. Oh. And you'll never get to explain to me visually what titty fucking is. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> yes, points. He can ex- still explain it. Yeah, not visually, though. I mean, my dad showed me physically. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> to himself wait, on you he did the self <laughs> um, did wait the self you know what up. i i did i had a grand a grandfather go blind right okay. like oh, lost oh, his shit. sight Dang so it was a lot of like <laughs> a lot of like physical contact when you'd come visit him he'd like feel your it's body like, <laughs> yeah well not, that's anders not necessarily that yeah what yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, go sit in there <laughs> Whoa, what's happening? I mean, <laughs> happy things. I'm not going to stop you. Yes. <laughs> but he, I remember he made me explain like what Ninja Turtles were to him. Because he just was like, I don't understand. And I'm like, what? Oh, he's there's... like, they're turtles. I go, well, they, they, they stand up like humans, but they have shells. And <laughs> they're teenagers. So, yeah, so they love pizza they? and partying, and they yeah. all have the crush on. The news reporter. Yeah. yeah. Oh, bring I it get full that circle. part. That part I get. Do you guys ever think about people who died a while ago that you knew? Always. Like my grandfather. <laughs> and like, they just, yes. they're never going to put on those Apple, like, pro visor goggle things. I think about that shit all the time. I'm like, you missed out. <laughs> I think about that shit Goodbye. all the time because my grandpa, like, loved tech. And I'm like, dude, he would love VR. Yeah. <laughs> he would fucking flip on some VR right now, dude. Right? Dude, it, I mean, the- that's so surprising. I got my parents one of those Oculus Rift g- goggles. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. I'm like, oh, they're kind of cool and you could do cool weird stuff in yeah. the metaverse. Yeah, you can metaverse do some good or... stuff with those. <laughs> yeah. You're talking about looking at porn. I've never done it. I've never done it, so I've never done it. Well, it's pretty crazy. Yeah. I haven't. For real. It's okay, pretty, but it's the way almost, you said it I know, leads that, me to yeah. believe that you're just talking about porno. That yeah. was like the joke, but if I'm being real, I have never watched porno in a VR well, space. Is it because it's almost you have real. two child, young children running around your house? Yes, or? very okay. scared about what oh, may yeah. happen, and I won't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, because also, like, you can't really hear much. Don't exactly. And they, that exactly. would be the most traumatizing thing to walk in on your, your, uh, your father, <laughs> just being like, my father. <laughs> Yeah, because <laughs> yeah, you're doing some fun stuff in the porno world, yeah. you know? Yeah. He's just, the fuck? You're just on the side of a couch, just like... The fuck? <laughs> the fuck is happening here? <laughs> <laughs> the cause of diarrhea. The fuck? 
You're, they're and just and if you're listening at home, I'm fucking the air. <laughs> Right now, I'm fucking there. Sexual, as some uh, say. What's so cool is they're just trying to do their homework, and then all of a sudden the door opens, and you walk in butt naked Dad. like... Dad! <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, my God. Dad, that's my ear. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. No. Your ears. Oh, hey, now that's... That's your ear, huh? Oh, yep. That's that, why. That would be a crazy Jesus. final destination right there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Yeah. You what st- was the deal in like those, all the horror movies when like someone would get like a blade through the skull? They'd just be like, <laughs> "Oh yeah, yeah." I would love to get cast in one of those deaths. Let's see it. You know, I've I've been oh, murdered. Be I've been, have you ever been murdered in a movie? I've been murdered once. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think so. In the Final Girls, I did this little horror comedy movie called The Final Girls. Hey, where that's yeah. That it's movie, a cool movie rocks. You guys should watch it. That Ow! movie rocks. Yeah, I I met my wife in that movie. And, yeah, you did. Uh, yeah, and I get like choked out with a telephone wire in the movie. That's okay. hot. Yeah, and then I'm like all bloody, and then I get, I also, and then it like I forget exactly, but I come back to life and I get shot out of a car, and then I scorpion and my body snaps in half. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You mean like the car stops, you go through the windshield? I go through the windshield and then I land, and then my body goes. Yeah, legs over back yeah. of head. So I good. Like that. So good. <laughs> What did that? Did it? Did, was it interesting when you saw it? Did you? Were you like, "Whoa, I'm dead"? Yeah. Did Did it fuck you up? Yeah. yeah. Did that, no, like, no, no, no. My mom. Like, weirdly, my mom was like, "I just couldn't watch it." But during the scene of Game Over Man, when I'm autoerotic asphyxiating <laughs> myself, and my dick is in my hand, and the bad guys come in, and then I fight like these it. terrorists with my dick out, and you see maybe my butthole in the movie. <laughs> And I fight these guys naked for like five minutes. Yeah. My mom r- leans over, grabs my thigh during this scene, and she goes, whispers, I'm so proud of you. <laughs> and sincerely, yeah. it wasn't like a ha-ha, because my mom's not funny in that way. She was just like, look at you up there. Right. Oh, yeah. Bearing well, it all for comedy. The theater was <laughs> roaring. Yeah. And yeah. she was like, I'm not wearing Underwear. No, oh. she was in Durs. As a was joke, she... as a joke. Oh, <laughs> well then, kind of funny. Not like 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 what you're doing, Adam. Okay, that mom. would be actually bad. Yeah. If your mom was like, I'm gonna be like you. I'm just like you. Hey. My butthole's pretty loose. Butthole from your dad. Like, Check out this. We shot. We shot the scene. <laughs> Nightmare. I'm playing you. Wow. Loose Dude, that would be well, a trip. <laughs> that hey, Kyle. Yeah. It would. <laughs> It would I, be. I, I'm stoked on that. That's cool that she encouraged you. It would be different if she watched that death scene and she was like, yeah! Finally! Ooh, ah, ah. <laughs> yeah. He's dead. Stupid Adam's funny. gone. Yes. And you're like, Mom, it's a movie. I'm right here. And she's like, oh, oh shit. shit. <laughs> no, I no. feel like my dad was like that. My dad was like, sick death. <laughs> Right. That's how I want to go. Shoot me out of a Camaro, baby. <laughs> right. Right. So I gave him these Oculus Rifts, dude. He goes, wow, cool. And then put it on and goes. Mm-hmm. And I go, are you doing it? And he goes, oh, yeah, cool. And I go, what are you seeing? He goes, all kinds of stuff. And I go, well, do you want me to show you how to, like, turn it, like turn it go? Right. And you can <laughs> climb on. Mount Everest yeah, out of the living you room. can go yeah. do some cool stuff. Or I can show you porn up. Uh, <laughs> but I can show you like some cool stuff to do. And he's like, I figured it out. Wow. <laughs> and I'm like, they never use it again. Yeah. <laughs> you just put it down and it's... It is it. kind of like super limiting. Because I'm like, oh shit, I'm going to go to like Lakers game, courtside. And then <laughs> sure. I just went into a room where you're supposed to like find the tickets. And someone just walked up to me and was like, hey, what's up, man? And I was like... <laughs> <laughs> Because I was up on the couch by myself late night, and I was like, I'm not talking to this person. <laughs> Dude, it is weird because you could go into comedy clubs. You can go into comedy. This is embarrassing. You can go into comedy clubs, and there's comics. And I like know all the comics that are working today, right? And so they're friends of mine that are on stage. And, and uh, this kid, he was probably like, I mean, he sounded like a child, but it's an avatar. And he's laughing. I'm like, oh, you think this guy's pretty funny? And he's like, yeah, he's okay. And I'm like, oh, yeah. And then I go, you ever watch uh, Workaholics? And he goes, ah, yeah, I guess so. I'm like, what do you think of Adam Devine? And he goes, fucking sucks. <laughs> oh, gotcha. 
to the damn. But that's just the next generation. The generation fucking thing. They're just a little sensitive. You know, that's Gen Z. Yeah, it must be. Oh, Gen Z is the most insensitive, unsupportive group. Speaking of beer, Isaac? Uh oh. Isaac. Isaac. Can we. I think he fell asleep. I need my Utah jazz. Wake up. I call this I call this my jazz. Isaac Horn, everybody. Here's our manager, Isaac. Show us your tits, Isaac. Show us your tits. How about your butt? Let's see your I want to see your butt cheeks. Hey, show us your tits. Your butt cheeks. We've yeah, asked him every show to show us <laughs> his titties because he's our adult manager um, who has the pinkest nipples. <laughs> quite pink. Quite, and it's quite actually pink. like a little off-putting when you see it. You're like, yeah. you just want to milk them? Yeah, so we just, <laughs> we just want you guys to see them. Yeah. Pizza, know? pizza. Want to share the wealth, but he refuses to yeah. do so. They're, 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 they're like... Soupy. Wait, what? Soupy? Soupy. Oh, soupy. Yeah, soupy? like like the Soup? rest of the chest seems firm, but then the nipples very like fluid, like wavy. Man, it's like on like acid you could, or something. His yeah. nipples are on acid. He's got dude. like uh, what's the dude's name with the melting clocks? Salvador oh, Dali, Dali nipples. Yeah. He's got like those Dali nipples. <laughs> dude's got some Dali nipples. <laughs> so they look like they're like melting and well, shit. That, I just feel like. He's pretty firm. We're very, we're really proud of him. He's lost a lot of weight recently. He looked yeah, horrible. Yeah, he used to be a fat piece of shit. And uh, <laughs> now, now he's just uh, you not so obese. Much. So it, it's firm, but the nipple part just looks like it's a little loose. Like it, really? it, it like it could go anywhere. Like chew, Damn. chew, chew. What's gonna gun? happen I mean, to my are, body are, when I finally get it back? I feel like I'm, <laughs> I've, 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 I've bloated to the point of too late. Loose skin. My, my, uh, maybe I've been there for a long time because my nipples have zero firmness to them whatsoever. <laughs> Let me feel Your them. Your boobs are huge. Yeah, there's nothing there. Go ahead now and take your shirt just... off. Oh. Yeah. Wait, we, I yeah. think we covered this. Yeah. Did you guys ever have the weird thing behind your nipples? The balls. Like when you were like 13, 14, 15? Yeah, the balls. Yeah. Do we, did we figure out what that... Whoa, those guys... Are you sex guy knows exactly or what he is. That's my cause! <laughs> did That's his out? charity. He's yeah, like, it's fine. Ball titties! What uh, was it? Because it was like a prepubescent thing. What, what is this ball, well, this see, marble? You guys have talked about this before. I do, I'm also... A man. I'm okay. a man. <laughs> yeah, sure. Yes. And I I'm was a, a prepubescent boy. <laughs> okay. And no longer with I feel like you're just bragging stash. now. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, what? But I never felt balls behind my titties. <laughs> Did you ever squeeze your titties super hard? Oh, every day. Age? Every day. <laughs> okay. Dude. Well, every day. No, no. Every day. There Always was like a firm. Them. There was I'm a like, firm, bulbous. And I'm then like, when you would squeeze it, it hurt like hell. Yeah. I might still yeah. have some. Whoa. Do you love him? With some soda water. No, I don't. Oh, he, he sent the drink back. What did he do? Whoa, Let's hear. You we sent gotta hear him it. back. What happened? You what sent happened, him back. Dude? Are you good? Well, he made the wrong drink. What did he make? Water? No, I wanted a vodka Red Bull. So you cut it with soda water, dude. It's my classic order. It's my go juice mixed with a little extra go go. And what did he forget? He he forgot to cut it. It would have been too much go. You need oh. to cut it. <laughs> It's oh. <laughs> <laughs> been wild. I thought maybe he just brought out like vodka on ice, and I'm like, let's go, baby. A glass of vodka. <laughs> Utah. Is that what it takes to excite you? Vodka on ice? Like a, a vodka Red Bull, not enough for you. It's gotta be Malort. <laughs> Did he just shout out Malort? <laughs> a well, Malort Red Bull. I mean, a, few, a few nights ago, we were in Indianapolis, and I accidentally drank a half bottle of vodka myself. Mm -hmm. Oops. And then we went out and then we also got way more drunk and I don't remember going to sleep and then <laughs> Blake ended up with a ton of wounds on I him. I did. I'm still healing. It's almost healed. Yeah. Oh, dude. Yeah. yeah. Gotcha. But I took, a gnar I took a gnarly spill. It wasn't a spill. No, you did you it on purpose. on purpose. Yeah. That's still a spill whether it's on purpose or not. I don't know true. if that's true. No, a that's spill true. is... Yeah, a spill. No. You can take a... That's a total misnomer. Oh, because it's that's a, a stunt. misnomer. <laughs> it's a stunt if you do it on purpose. If you do it on purpose, it's a stunt. Fair. If you yeah. do it on accident, it's a spill. Right. And if you don't know which is which, it's a Isaac misnomer. Isaac Horn, everybody. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Yeah. Nucky Grandma. Wee-oo. 
I never can see when he's coming, and it always freaks me out. I don't yeah, know why he, he always comes from this he side. You'll be okay. Okay, here comes a taste test. It's Let's fine. see. What, how is it? Too much water. <laughs> Send it back. <laughs> oh, that's strong. It's science. Okay. Okay, right, so he okay. likes it. Good. Isaac, no, I need a little popozow. Okay, you got your popozow. Popozow! Yo. <laughs> Have you guys ever been to Salt Lake City before? Utah! Dude, we... Right? We went together to film Awesomeness Maximus for Comedy Central, right? Hey, shut up. We don't bring up that movie. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them what it is. Dude, we did the worst you movie. You guys went all the way out here to shoot that movie? Yeah. Yeah, maybe they like... They were like... They, they read the script and they're like, you can't shoot this in LA. <laughs> <laughs> you have to go elsewhere. <laughs> it was so bad, dude. We, was this a 300 spoof? It, it was, was. It was a what 300 was, who started? spoof. It was Gladiator? our first movie that Blake and I, or one of the very first things that we had ever done, mm -hmm. and it was called Awesomeness Maximus. We were in the National Lampoon family at that point. We were yes. doing a lot of work. Do you remember in the early 2000s when National Lampoon was still making movies, but it was all just like, titty twisters. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, and it was exactly what you think it is. It's like the period <laughs> after Van Wilder. It just got bad. Yeah. Right. Yeah, it was good, and then they were like, well, let's make 60 really bad movies called Balls Out. Yeah. National Lampoon's <laughs> Hollywood. Nighttime. Yeah, and then we came out, but we only came for like an afternoon. I feel like they flew us out here, and then they're like, get the National fuck out. Lampoon's Beach Penis. Yeah, uh, yeah, we didn't really explore. We this didn't is really... called Volcano Snatch. <laughs> we didn't really explore the city, but... National Lampoon's Keggerator. <laughs> Time traveling kegerator. <laughs> the time traveling have kegerator you, have you guys, is cool. Have you guys been here or no? No, I've been to Park City for Sundance. I've been to years Park ago. City for Sundance. Yeah. Yeah. And I want to go back. I'd love to go back to Sundance this year, actually. Oh. Yeah. It was yeah. cool. I was walking around with, uh, oh, God, who's the guy? He's like a basketball announcer. Marv Albert. No, no, no. He, he was one of the Michigan five, Fab Five. Uh, Jalen Rose. No, other guy. Um, Chris Webber. Chris Webber. Yes. Chris Damn it. Fox. Yes. Fuck. So Chris, Chris Webber. Yes, dude. You're an pro idiot, Blake. Produced this okay, movie yeah, I did. You got points for that. Yes, and, points. And we're, we're walking around Park City. And we pass this group of people, and I overhear them go, oh, my God, that was R. Kelly. <laughs> R <laughs> and I was like, uh, Chris Webber. <laughs> Short, funny story. Those people thought you were R. Kelly. And he was like, <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> yeah. I was like, Admittedly, <laughs> I wouldn't want to be confused with R. Kelly either. <laughs> like, he's a very successful man, but... Yeah, that's when he's got some issues. Yeah, but, successful no, no, no. man butt. That, National <laughs> Lampoon, successful man butt. <laughs> that's if, it, if you're an earshot of that and you hear someone mistake you as R. Kelly, you run back and you're like, wait, I'm wait, not wait. him actually. I'm yeah. not. This is my driver's license? Not, yep. You can uh, check it right here. I'm, it's here's not a me. second form. Yeah. Uh, Dude, what are the funniest people that you've been, uh, they thought you were? Well, oh, I, you, I mean, mine are. How much vodka did they put in here? <laughs> Mine are pretty obvious. I still Carrot get top. Carrot Top, uh, Sean White, Sean White, uh -huh. yeah. dude, uh, on that Hermione. <laughs> <laughs> on that uh, on that night that we that you drank the half bottle of vodka and we went to that bar, the That's Beaver. Right. It was like the Beaver Bar or whatever. Remember that place? The, yeah, the, it was. Like, bar. All the shirts said like "Save a tree, eat a beaver." And I was like, yeah, and so cool. Blake the right. next morning. Bought an extra small and came down the lobby with a little belly shirt that says, save a tree, eat a beef. Oh, hey, two. man. And by the way, it fit him perfectly. It was. It was great. It looked good. Yeah, it looked really Natural good on hard him. Body. So, Thanks, man. That I took, night. I took a spill, so what can I say? <laughs> that night in that bar, I got Steve Aoki not once, but two times. <laughs> Wait. Uh, Steve Aoki is a, a the, variation DJ. The DJ, yeah. <laughs> Ah, yeah, <laughs> I know. I mean, Two I guess I see it. I see my you guys was, both have ponytails. My hair right? was down. Okay, that, yeah. that's oh, what but happened, dude. You don't remember? You were th throwing cake at people. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's why. Fair enough. I got a. <laughs> hey, no points. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I got a. a I was in an, like an Uber or a, a car service, and this guy was like, "Man, I know you, right?" <laughs> and I'm like, "Oh yeah, I'm an actor." And he's like, "Oh, I, I knew it. I recognize you." 
And then I'm like, oh, cool, cool. And then at the very end of the ride, he goes, man, I loved Goonies. <laughs> no. Yep. <laughs> right. Yeah. So he either thought I was Chunk <laughs> or Sean Astin. And both of those men are... 55 years old. Hey, yeah, man. it's like he thought time You got arms like Goonies. sloth, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude, I do got those sloth arms. He was like, are you sloth? <laughs> yeah, you just said, duh. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, hey, you guys. Rocky. Rude. I knew it was you. <laughs> Honestly, like, I feel like, I think the sloth dude actor died, but, like, the sloth workout program, get jacked like sloth, I would try that out. <laughs> yeah. What? Body by sloth. And oh, don't get me started, dude. Sloth. All I want to do is be a fitness influencer. Because yeah. they have it made, dude. All they do is work out. All the people they hang out with, hot as fuck. Yep. All they do is cold plunge and hang out in little steam baths dude, together. What a dream. I can't believe we have to sit on a stage and talk for a living. I know. This uh, is a nightmare. This job fucking is kill us now. I just want to be on an assault bike for three yeah. hours a day. Just. <laughs> <laughs> Should we do with some hot topics? Oh shit! Yeah, hold up. One All second. Right. Wait, let me get. Now my... let's get important here, guys. Yeah, hell Enough yeah. Of this bullshit. Beautiful drop. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. So, uh, Michelle Williams. Real Remember name? who is she? I think she's an actress. She's right? an actress extraordinaire. What? what is she Oscar here? winner. What did she? What did she win an Oscar for? Fucking. Save. Oh, she's a little blonde girl that's very m meek. Yeah, what is she, sure. <laughs> she was in like uh, the Steven Spielberg movie as the mom. Oh, she's uh, the fable. We work she's the in mom. this industry. Oh, she was married to Heath know. Ledger. Yeah. But but yeah. like we don't we don't need to saddle her with that. She's so much more. Yeah, she's the thank mom you. in the Fableman's. I got it. Fableman's okay. mom. So world class actress Michelle Williams. Narration of Britney Dawson's Creek. <laughs> Boom. Most importantly, Dawson's Creek. Joshua Jackson. Okay. I think she was in the. Another movie? Yeah, I'm sure she is. Well, yeah, she's been in movies. So been Michelle movies. Williams... Hey, shut the fuck up. Sorry. Shut, shut the fuck up. Michelle Williams' narration of Britney Spears' memoir goes oh, no. viral. She does imitations of Justin Timberlake's black scent. Mm -hmm. Oh, dear. <laughs> really? Well, she's a fantastic accent. Yeah. Uh, actress, you know, so... Yeah. She's such a great accent. <laughs> <laughs> she won an Oscar for best accent. That's cool. That's great. So it's crazy that Britney Spears, first of all, did a memoir. Mem memoir. <laughs> Shut up, bitch. Memoir. <laughs> Good. Jaguar. Yeah. A memoir. Isaac, what did you put in the drink, dog? Dude, you, Everclear, dude. Are you I took really? Oh, you're going to send the drink back? I'm going to fucking put it in. This, this I'll put Utah, you here's your fucking drink. The, the Utah show started uh, with us being like, yo, your shit ain't strong, and it's leaving with us like, Memoir. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, dude. These fucking Whoops. bros. <laughs> Memoir. Oops. These <laughs> fucking bros. <laughs> well, I love that she did uh, the Britney Spears memoir. All, by also, the way, like a G fucked move. Fucked up word, memoir. You have to drop the wall. It's French. I think it's called a memoir. Is it? It's French. You it's can say memoir. What? You can say memoir. It's okay to say you memoir. You can say no, whatever but you want. You're saying it, right. it wrong because it has to be a memoir. You can say memoir as well. I like yeah. memoir. But like, let's just establish that if someone calls and goes, hey, Britney Spears wrote a memoir, <laughs> and they want you to do the narration or like the to read it, and she said yes, fucking G. Yeah, she's... Awesome. Yeah. yeah. Right. And yeah. also, yes. if Justin Timberlake did Black Scent, then you have to also do Black Scent. Right. right. If you've never done Black Scent, even if you're black, what are you doing? I think I did Black <laughs> Scent when I was talking about my Uber driver. I was, he was like, hey, man. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe offensive to some people. Sorry no, about I'm it. Kiss now. <laughs> so these are mostly, I, I didn't really have a chance to look at all these topics, but they're mostly Justin Timberlake based. So oh, okay. really? Hit me with the second. Uh, okay, yeah, let's get okay. our fucking JT on. I'm bringing Blacks and Spanish. Cry me a river. So Justin, Justin Timberlake turns off Instagram comments amid backlash from Britney Spears' book. <laughs> what the hell? All right, we got to read these before. Uh... <laughs> so you could... We ate dinner instead. I love yeah. that the news is Wait, Justin he... Timberlake turned off his comments. Yeah, like, what the fuck? Yeah. Who cares? Yeah, okay. Who cares? I don't give Do you a want... fuck. Can we get a spotlight on Kyle? Classic, Kyle. Who cares? Kyle's going to go for five minutes. The classic Kyle rant. Go. No, it just who gives cares? a fuck about that shit, bro. Okay. Yeah, right. that's a very dumb... Relax. 
Yeah. Well, you turned off, you, turn off some comments. But to be fair, he did turn off his comments. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> pretty crazy. I'll tell you what, sometimes you got to turn off comments. I took a photo with Joe Biden once. Yeah. Those comments went right off. I was like, Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I turned a comment off. Hot. These are yeah. not compliments. Took, These are not yeah. compliments. Uh-uh. <laughs> Took a photo with an old man who ended up being president. <laughs> Gotta turn off the comments. Uh-huh. Click. <laughs> I do Ooh. love, I would love to see those. They'd be like, tell us about the aliens, Joe. And you're like, okay. What, that's what the comments would say? Those were I, I I was like, fuck you, Liptard. <laughs> I, was, I like that Durs thought the comments were, dude, did you see aliens? <laughs> what did you think they were? I think it was more libtard stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Although, dude, I love the super right-wing like slang for uh, liberal people, like libtard and snowflake yeah. and cuck. Hey, sign <laughs> me up for all that stuff. That's funny, dude. Cuck, Republicans cuck are stuff. way funnier. I'll say that. Way funnier. That's <laughs> true. Hit me with a... Uh, cucktard. <laughs> you got hey, hey you cucktard. Hit me with <laughs> you freaking snow cuck, all right. you cuck. I've got a cowboy hat. Hey, Fuck you. You're being such a snowflake bitch. <laughs> Taylor Swift is now a billionaire. Yeah. Oh, you Good for Taylor you. Swift. Yeah. Swift. Hey, Turn the comments off, Taylor. They're gonna get ugly. I hope she does like some sassy dumb shit with all her money now. <laughs> well, like, she's like, hey, guess what? In Nashville, all the roads are pink. <laughs> Oh, yeah. She could, that's dude. Tight. If you had a billion yeah, that's dollars. Kinda, that's yeah. kind of fire. Yeah. If you're just like, fuck it, dude. I got a billion bucks. Try to stop me. She's like, actually, Travis Kelsey, I'm going to encase you in gold. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like Han Solo. He got yeah. in the fucking thing. What, what do we think she's going to do with a billion dollars? She already bought a castle, right? She has a castle. Does Ooh. she? I think she has a castle. Do you think she just like LARPs and plays magic in D&D all the time? Dude, you and can have like, some sick-ass LARP get, sessions with dude, a billion bucks. Maybe. Okay, if I was Taylor Swift and I had that kind of money, Me? I would definitely yeah. <laughs> like... You finally, would, finally, you're talking about it on the pod. Go ahead. <laughs> you'd be at your house and all of a sudden you'd hear like a tap, tap, tap at your window. Yep. And you'd be like, what the hell? Is that a... Is that a raven with a scroll around its neck? Okay. And and okay. Be, you'd open your window and it'd be like yeah and and, and you'd open the scroll. Yeah, it is. <laughs> but the, does yeah. the does the raven have like one red eye? It's like a robot raven. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. It's a, no, it's got to be a trained. This raven. all seems to cost seventeen dollars so far. Okay. Yeah. Be a trained yes, raven. Are you trained? No, can one you imagine bird? a bird with a sheet of paper? <laughs> okay. Dog? You but think then, a trained raven is seventeen dollars? Window, Anderson windows, hella expensive. <laughs> then you. <laughs> You open the scroll. Yes. And it says. There's a rubber band on that shit. <laughs> Maybe two. <laughs> We're talking paper, people. This is, this is papyrus. Okay, it's really good paper. <laughs> this bitch oh. went to paper source and dropped fifty dollars on papyrus. <laughs> Anyways, the scroll says, Sir Adam, you've been invited to Lord Taylor Swift's. Castle. But I thought you're Taylor yeah, Swift. You have I, a billion dollars. Dollars. I took the money and I changed my name to Taylor Swift. <laughs> okay. uh, People are trying to follow. Did you, did you tuck your dick off or you just took the name Taylor Swift? Oh, no. I cut, you I cut fucking my, cut. I'm growing. I'm actually, I cut my dick off and I'm growing it into another human. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so trying to sell research. Yeah. 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 Okay. So that's where the money went. That's where all thought. the money okay. went. The yeah. crow just tells you to come over to my house, drink Mountain Dew and play D&D. Yeah. 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 That's actually yeah. sick. Yeah. Fuck yeah. It. yeah. What would you do with a billion dollars, okay. Durs? If I had a bil- billion dollars. Uh, is that Beach Boys? If I had a billion dollars, <laughs> yeah. I would give away $900 uh, million dollars <laughs> nerd. To, to people who need it. 100%. What do you need a billion dollars for? Okay. I'll, t- then, I'll tell you. And I'll then, tell you. And Wait. then, hey, uh, you asked me, so shut the fuck up. <laughs> and shut then, up, bitch. <laughs> I'd get this raven, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. And now we're talking. Upwards of two pieces of paper in a rubber band. <laughs> okay. You lose. Uh, if I had a billion dollars, I would just give it away. I would give okay. it away. Wow. So the biggest asshole of the crew, crew turned out to be the best. What am I gonna do? All. Like, yeah. what am I gonna do? Like, get two billion dollars? Who? F- hey, the person who said yes. <laughs> What are you a fucking idiot? <laughs> no, what are you cool. gonna What are you gonna do with two billion dollars? If we gave you fifty million dollars, you I, would lose your mind. Wait, is a billion no, one hundred millions? It. Is that what this is? Is that the number we're talking about? What just a happened? Thousand. Is a billion 
One hundred millions or it's one? A, it's a thousand millions. Donkey! A, thou- it's a, thousand a thousand millions. millions. A thousand. That's, a, that's too much. It's yep. so much money that unless you're a fucking giant asshole. <laughs> Then you're like, I think I could double this. I don't know, See, man. I wouldn't want to double it. Here's what I would do. Here's what I would do. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. And by the way, so, quiet. You really it's, got it's different if you're somebody who has, like, some sort of intelligent vision of how to, like, grow something. Yeah, I right? grow. I, I said don't. grow my penis into another me. Yeah. And I and said that, intelligent. And that made a <laughs> lot of I sense said intelligent. to me. That made a lot of sense to me. So here's what I would do. Have you ever wanted to, you know, like, I like going hunting and shooting defenseless animals. I want to be a That's a thing that I like. Where are you going with this? What the hell? I can solve homeless people's problems <laughs> because in Los surviving Angeles. Surviving the game already exists. I know what I'm doing. No, no, no. So, I like shooting things from the sky. So, have you ever seen a plane and you were like, man, I wonder if I had a rocket launcher. What? I know where he's going with this. Okay, keep going. No one's on the plane. (laughs) No one's on the plane. I'm not a murderer. I'm a billionaire. I'm a fun billionaire. You invite all your homies over for a fun luncheon. The spread is fantastic. How big is this plane? We're talking. We're not to the plane yet. We're at the spread. (laughs) Okay, talk to me about the spread. Because I'm eating the spread. All the accoutrements. (laughs) Schlotzky's. Yeah, Yeah, Schlotzky's Deli is there. Okay. All the nuts, all the cheeses. You got Chex Mix? You got Chex Mix? (laughs) Chex Mix is there. All the My man has all the nuts. Yeah, there. So the spread is fantastic. There's taco trucks. It's a pizza. It's a sick thing. You went all out, Mr. Billionaire. Yes, I'm a billionaire. And then. And I, I go, you guys like, oh, what's up? Thank you for inviting us. This is a sick spread. And I go, y'all ever fuck with rockets? Oh, my. And they're like, your black sense a little much. <laughs> and, then, and then you guys go, I've actually never fucked with a rocket before. Never. And yeah. then I get out like no desire. a thousand rockets, dude. <laughs> no desire. Get There's a thousand, thousand rockets. rockets and yes. these rockets. Okay. Rocket and launch. and okay, we go. bought them back. From Iran. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay. So I'm actually doing good, Durs. I'm going like, hey, you don't. Give me your guns. Give me those back. Okay. You don't need all those. Give okay. me some of them rockets back. Okay. And I have so much money, then I'm like, all right, fuck it. Okay. Yeah. 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 You're, you're and so sure then I get all these planes. There has to be a pilot, right? Now we're and here. What, what the pilot does is he he's on a walkie-talkie, and then I go, jump. I'm still going to send it. Yeah, I go, I go, jump, jump. And then yeah. he jumps out. Yeah. And then we each take turns. <laughs> so what kind yeah. of planes are these? We're at the planes. We're past the planes. By the what way, kind of is, planes are these? So well, there's different two, sizes. There's two million different levels. dollars. 747. So the, no, there's like we start jets. with Cessnas. Then they get bigger and bigger until they're jets. And, and then we and get I, a, I know you don't want to think about this kind of stuff, but where are those planes landing? They're Utah. Hopefully they're, Hopefully they're not. Kyle. Utah. Kyle, did no. you listen at all? He's exploding them. Wait. What? Yeah, but there's still pieces that are going somewhere. Where are they going, man? Dude, we're in open Relax, fields. Relax, dudes. We're he's in open fields. They're landing on animals out in the middle of nowhere. No, he's I don't a wanna... billionaire. They, he put up a big net. Oh, big ass net. Yes. Nice. Big net. Big nice. Net. Yes. So that's what I would do. What would the you do? The brains think, of the operation. Yeah. Honestly, I'd probably just make whatever fucking movie I wanted to see. <laughs> okay. That's an okay. expensive movie. No, I would make a book yeah. for the rest of my life, and I'd make a ton of them that I just want to see. Okay, cool. That's just a very real answer. That's okay. what I would do. Okay. Yours Boring. was funny. Yours was funny. Mine is real. Well, mine was also <laughs> very real. So. Yeah. I don't well, why don't you cry it. about it? Oh, shit. Holy shit, man. Okay. By I, the way, I would give everyone in here a million. Yeah. Uh, and, yeah. And, and yeah. guess what? That's my shirt. I, I'd give you guys more money. No. <laughs> So Kevin Federline, it's all Britney movies. Spears based. What Kevin is Federline left his family. What the hell? Dude, this is actually a Popo sad Sa! thing. You guys remember Kevin Federline, Britney Spears' husband? That's his voice on the Popo Zao He thing. left his family for his Popo Zao career. Popo Zao! What? Yeah. Can he you bailed. say that uh, one more time for me, please? Kevin Federline left his family for his... Oh shit! My bad. I, I'm I'm getting Kevin a Federline, I, I'm getting a ton of airdrops. Yeah, so. that's so hey, turn that off. <laughs> okay, hey, I'm gonna do it again and then drop it. Yeah, Kevin Federline. Kevin Federline left his family for his Popo Sal career, dude. I okay. Still, am not quite understanding what he did. So he evidently had an ex girlfriend who was eight months pregnant with their second baby. Nice. Uh, and he also had a toddler when Britney Spears started dating him, and he was just like. 
Oh, Popo's out. <laughs> Popo's out. Oh, this is like back in the day. Yeah, so this, this is, is all from Britney Spears. What year book, is this dude? topic from? Yeah, is this, this is top- off Yahoo it's not News? Topical. Fucking 2002. No. <laughs> well, I guess Britney Spears' uh, mem- memoir. Oh yes, just oh, dropped. So now we're okay. getting all these hot tidbits, and now you see why she's in her bikini dancing with knives. <laughs> right. You're like, say it. She's she's led a hard life. I love that. She's what? <laughs> No, she's not. She's just. I, I don't. That girl goes, she's okay. Yeah. No, she isn't. Like, with zero judgment, I don't know if she's okay. No, she's not okay. I don't know if she's not okay, but I don't know I mean, if I she do is weird okay. shit when I'm alone in my house. I walk around naked. That's I so see weird. If my dick can touch the linoleum. <laughs> huh, what? It can't. Well, okay, cool. What is that? <laughs> like, you just you try to get low. You try to get low with it. Careful, don't hurt yourself. I can't. Yeah. Get up! Oh, do you guys really? remember? Do you remember the joke from childhood where it's like, so there's three guys who are competing for the world's longest dick. Sure. Yep. <laughs> Always. They're, they're all on top of the Sears Tower. Okay. And the first guy hangs his dick over the edge, <laughs> and it goes down to the like 35th floor, and they're that's like, "Holy insane. shit, that's a huge that's dick!" That's huge. That's and they're like, "That's huge." That's and he goes, fucking... "Yeah." And the guy, the next guy goes, "That's nothing." <laughs> He hucks his rod over the ledge, (laughs) and it goes down to the 17th floor. Holy shit. That must be the world's biggest dick. I'm a dude. But then they turn back to the third guy, and he's like... (laughs) And they're like, yo, man, what what are you doing? He's like, I'm dodging traffic. (laughs) (laughs) This was like... No, I... When you're like eight or nine years old, yeah, yeah. Dude. just one you had in the chamber that, for honest, summer camp. Honestly, that's how my dad explained the birds and the bees. <laughs> <laughs> so the reason you're here is because... And then he was like, and also what you can do with that huge dick, you can titty fuck. When you're not dodging traffic, you can make babies. <laughs> Hit me with it. Uh, hell yeah, dog. I'm on this today. Hit me with it. World, hey guys, this is actually pretty crazy. World's oldest dog ever. Okay. Mm. Ever. I what, know about it. 30? Dies I, at 31, dude. Oh my God. So Whoa. fucking close, dude. Yeah. Wow. Pretty what's, wild. What's crazy? I, when Anna, our producer, brought this up, I was like, is it the Australian cattle dog? Uh oh. And she was like, uh, yes. You no, fucking weirdo. You it's knew it it's was in the Portugal. Catalog? It doesn't say if it's on Australia. I'm reading the breed, the breed. The breed. The breed. Oh, it doesn't say anywhere on here. She told me. The breed of Portuguese dog that is an. Portuguese. Is a, no, uh, a purebred Rafiero do Ateo. <laughs> I don't Where give a fuck. Where did you say it? A, a Rafiero. Why did she do. tell me? Oh, was the one that was oh, before this is that? A hard word. Anna? No, was, she, was the previous oldest no, so, dog an Australian it's a cattle Rafael dog? Du Antejo. So uh, like, Alan, Alan Tejo. Oh she boy, yeah, I'm gonna stop. Dude, the previous so guys, one, the previous one was an Australian yeah, so cattle you're dog. Yeah, you're a liar. So. Okie dokie. <laughs> and I think I nailed it. You guys came over like you I did can't a great read. Job. And you did it's a, a Rafaelo Du Antero. <laughs> That's a breed of uh, Portuguese that's a, dog that is an average life expectancy of 10 to 14 years. This dog is as old as my wife. <laughs> yeah. That's an so, old dog. Wait, that's a cool but, way to put it. I yeah. mean, was that dog... That's a fun way. Was it completely fucked up, blind, like it shit's just dropping out of its asshole? Or was it... Is that what you no want? way, dude. Have you ever seen, like... My my wife, her dog was 18 years old when I met I it. You're gonna be like, and it, my wife is she just shits on the carpet. <laughs> She's so old. No, my wife had a super old dog named Bitsy, named after Britney Spears' dog, weirdly. Okay. And, uh, it looked like a fucking wizard, dude. Oh yeah. It would just gray. stand there with like glossed over eyes, just with long gray yeah. hair. What what kind of dog? Like a mutt? What are we talking? Dude, like I know a, what you're talking about. The like a lap dog, when, a when, they, when they have the gloss over look, and it looks like they can talk to you in your own mind. Yeah, right. Like are you talking just, about like the milky eyes? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, you yeah, start yeah. to hear a voice, and it's like, go in the kitchen. That's right. like Summer of Sam, dude. Did yeah, the dog dude. tell him to do that shit? It's like... That's uh, my dog was so old. I remember my, my dog's like... Tiana. Would just, yeah, Tiana. Tiana Shout would just like Tiana. walk around and uh, not even walk to stand there all day. You had a dog named Tiana? Yeah. Tiana. Okay. Okay. 
Uh, that sounds like, like Horn, everybody. the sexiest dog name I've ever heard. Yeah, yeah. Yana, yeah, why did dude. you name your dog? Did your dog, dog have like no, a fucking dog, the dog why came you, with the name? We didn't why, name the dog. Dog oh, came yeah. with the name. Well, We're what not kind that of cool? weird freak <laughs> names <laughs> their dog the sexiest name ever? And then they're like, it's too sexy. I got to get rid of it. They're like, yeah. coming up to the well, stage, you might end up Tiana. Fucking it. Tiana. <laughs> but she would just, shit would just fall out of her ass. Yeah, I remember that. Like, it was just like, and there was like really hard, dry shits. And it's like, what's going yeah. on inside of your body? Yeah, that, that was really sad. It was sad. R.I.P. All yeah. dogs up so there. So that you know sucks. <laughs> Can we do some Q&As? I would love that. Yeah. Thank you for the questions. So you guys asked some hard-hitting cues. And Here we come got the some answers. sweet, sweet A's for you. Amon from Idaho. Yep. Woo. Oh, yes. I guess Amon's yes. throwing his voices because he's from several different places in yeah. this audience. Amon so from Idaho either. drove five hours for TII Nation. Do not come. My guy, yes. my guy. And this guy evidently wants Jim Carrey to die. What? Because he says, can we give him his flowers? No. And no, we're not going to give Jim oh, Carrey yeah, no. flowers. We'll give him flowers. Because props. if you follow the podcast yeah. at all, you know if we give someone their flowers, they're dead within the month. Yeah. yeah. It's not good. So there's no way. So I will say happening. Jim Carrey fucking rules. And yeah. he's probably the reason I'm in oh. comedy. Yep. Oh, yep. yep. Yeah. Yep. Formative uh, voice. Yeah. I, I remember watched, I watched the pilot to In Living Color two nights ago. Okay. Weird. <laughs> it's called Knowing Your History. Yeah, uh -huh, sure. Uh -huh. Okay, it's doing your research. Yeah, I think it's cool. I, uh, he I killed cool. it. Episode one. What? I remember oh, yeah. my dad called me down the stairs as I was a little boy to watch Fire Marshal Bill. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. Fire Marshal Bill. He's like, you gotta watch this. This shit's funny. That shit was scary. He's yeah. like, let me show you something. Yeah. 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 yeah he was. It was frightening. Uh, favorite favorite best Jim Carrey movie, TV show, go? The Sonic 2. <laughs> the Grinch. I so like, his new, Sonic I like his new stuff. Oh, dude, yeah. I know. I mean, I really love Eternal Sunshine. I'm okay. that guy. Yeah, dude. I'm fucking that guy. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm sure, a, dude. But that's the one he was trying. Bro, <laughs> I'm a... I'm, I fucking... I dig it. Man, I I, I'm you know? a huge Nerd. The Majestic guy. Right. Yeah, what about Bro. the number 23? Yeah, man. The number 23 is his best I don't, You know what? I'll be honest. I don't like what's happening right now. <laughs> no. Sorry. I feel like if James Carey himself was listening, because that's how he was listed on yep. uh -huh. the pilot of In Living Color, uh -huh. if he was listening to this right now, he'd be like, do these guys hate me? Are they making fun? Yeah, of they're making going fun. Yeah. The spotless mind is real. What I, what I did was I laid the floor for you guys Dude, to be sweet that's a nice. great movie, but that's not the best Jim Carey. Come on. Oh, that can't be your favorite Jim Carey when he's not doing Jim Carey. Well, then it would be, okay, my favorite Ace... My favorite Ace Ventura movie is Ace Ventura <laughs> yeah, 2. Ace Ventura 2? <laughs> two? Okay. 2. I like 2. Oh, I'm a 2 guy. I do like that I taught my... I showed my kids the rhino scene. Oh, yeah. And now whenever we go anywhere that has like rhinos, like a zoo or like a book with rhinos, they're like, kind of hot in these rhinos. <laughs> cool kids. Okay, kid. So Wano. good. So Colin Whipple is, going, is asking... Colin? Whip, whip. Not real. Fake name. Whipple. Talk about the rat buster scene from Workaholics. Uh, oh, okay. yeah, the rat buster. So we busters. actually, we, we had, it, this was based on a, a true story where we lived, me, Blake, and Kyle lived in the Workaholics house where we shot the show. And before we got the show, we had this crazy rat infestation and Dude. also during the show. But, Water trash. Yeah. But uh, we set up a ton of traps, like our own, being like, we're going to catch these rats. And we caught something like 25 rats in... Yeah, because we just kept Woo. resetting it in the attic, and we could go outside and like have a beer, and we just hear, yeah. and then you're like, oh, that's it. And that's then another one. And then one night, well, they late at night, I remember I was in bed with my girlfriend. I know, and uh, <laughs> it happened. This is the way. No big deal. And I I heard like a, and a rat was crawling into my room, and I knew what he was doing. And my girlfriend goes, "What's that?" And I go. It's old plumbing. <laughs> it's old plumbing, yeah. yeah. It's so old, this plumbing. These rats were brave. They would yeah. go from room to room looking for crumbs. Dude, it's like, like this, just like... Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. What a bitch. <laughs> yeah, you trying to fuck her? <laughs> <laughs> not on my watch. You got some cheeses? That's Cheez exactly nah. what happened, dude. You got some cheeses in here? <laughs> it's, you got some elbows? No, and no joke, climbed up onto our bed. Where are you getting some butterfingers? I fingers? kicked it off of our bed. Yep. 
I heard her go, <laughs> like, <laughs> like little squeal. She was like, what the fuck is that? I'm going like, to kick me like that? It's the plumbing. It's, <laughs> it's the plumbing. It's and then like three dog. days later, she went home. Three days later, I had had enough. And I, that's the night of many kills when I went to our kitchen Woof. wearing nothing but boxer shorts. Armed with a bottle of Windex, Windex and a broom. And a close your eyes. We close your bag. eyes for that one. Yep. And I murdered six rats by hand. Yeah, you did. They were brutal. They were it was brutal. brutal it death. Was That's like... just another night in Salt Lake City. <laughs> so we had oh. we had to film that. We had know. to do that. So then we knew when we shot the show that we had to murder a ton of rats. That scene has. You talk. Some... Yeah. Is there are there any great... other details, guys? Um, I just was at the door listening to Adam have sex with his girlfriend, and he thought it was a rat. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was a rat scratching at the door. Oh, it was something that. we got a lot of blowback for, <laughs> like when the episode aired. People lost their shit and were like, first of all, they're not real rats that no, we're right. killing. They were and like, second water of all, balloon. even if they're real rats, who cares? <laughs> yeah, but I always thought that that, because there's some really good cuts in that montage where you really cut last minute and then big ass fucking blood blurred. So yeah. I always thought it was cool that yeah. people were pissed because they thought it was real. This yeah. is rock and roll. Yeah. It was yeah, just... it's cool. Yeah. So Emily Shelby, Shebby wants to know. What should I get as my next tattoo? Also, I'm doing an impression of Emily. Also, can you give my friend Maggie, who couldn't be her, a shout out? No. <laughs> Not going to do that. She should have bought a ticket. Yeah. You know? If Maggie wanted a shout out. Friendship. If Maggie wanted a shout yeah. out, Maggie would have been here. Yeah, that's right. Maggie. And then I would have given Maggie a shout yeah. out. Yeah. Maggie, Maggie, Maggie. Not what? happening, Maggie. What was the other Sorry, question? Sorry, Mags. What was no the other shout part out of for it? you. There was a tattoo part. I know that. The, yeah, that's the What should I part. get as my next tattoo, says Emily? Ooh. Just like it's maybe, maybe a tramp stamp that points down and says tight butthole. Yeah. That'd be kind of maybe, maybe tasteful. That. Yeah, yeah, maybe I that. I feel like tramp stamps have gone. They're, the way they're the gone. Dodo. Now I right. feel like you got to get page. a little cursive tattoo on your clavicle right here. Are people still doing this one on the ribs? That's hot. Tight, tight rib I, cage. Also, it's, no, weird. it's keep... weird that we call them tramp stamps because that's like a, it's like, a, you know, you're trying to be like, oh, that girl's a tramp. What the fuck? What are you, a yeah. tramp? I just think she likes cool barbed wire tattoos. Right and above nautical above. star tattoos on her lower back. And yeah. I just think she's or a cool butterfly. Right. And I getting, think she's just tight. And like getting railed a lot. Well have you guys <laughs> seen that now people are do you guys see now people are doing like full black ink tattoos? Oh a s- sleeve sleeve. Sleeves the whole body. Yeah, I'm down yeah. for that. That's Covered. some like Rage Against the Machine shit. That's fucking cool. You know who dude. started that? And then the, guy you can from, get, the guy from Gigolo started that shit. Oh really? We They're all right. know it. We all know it. The guy from Gigolos. <laughs> we all know it. He Zero started. people have seen that show. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> so Lizzie Sheb- Shebby, all, um, they must be sisters. Adam, have you ever eaten other shit? What? <laughs> I don't understand. Weird. Like other weird things, not including the rotisserie chicken string. <laughs> oh, okay. Which I don't know if everyone knows. I ate a rotisserie chicken, and then a day later I shit out the string that holds it all together. Diarrhea. And I thought I had the largest tapeworm known to man. I was like... <laughs> rotisserie tape. Diarrhea. What's happening? <laughs> and then I looked at him like, this held my rotisserie chicken together. <laughs> Delicious. Yum, yum, yum. Uh, no, that was a first for me. I'm not always having weird... <laughs> Not edible things kind of out of my asshole. Just, you know, yeah, what, what do you guys think wood? he is? Crazy? <laughs> yeah. yeah. He just I, eats the strings off of chickens. <laughs> Get off his case. Well, when you're eating a rotisserie chicken, you're fucking going to send yeah, it. An- anything goes. <laughs> diarrhea. No, dude. Rotisserie chicken does not give me diarrhea, dude. If anything, it makes Prove me stronger it. and plugs me up. Prove it. <laughs> <laughs> Dan Wells wants to know, in the true Dromance episode of Orgaholics, when Carl says, freaking see ya, Uh and throws the DVD, was it intentional or an accident that he hit the light? Freaking see ya. Um, That was an accident, I'll be honest. I threw it as hard as I could. I maybe was, yeah, and then it just hit the light. Yeah. Okay. Hey, happy nice. accidents, guys. Kyle nice. Newcheck, everybody. Freaking see ya. Yeah, I am yeah. a happy accident. Yeah. Joe Dirt in the That's dirt. That's me. <laughs> so Valerie wants to know, 
how do you get out of a creative rut? Oh, this is a serious question. Ew, oh, Valerie, what are you Valerie, doing? Valerie, look for something that makes you have fun. Okay, just smile. Thank you, Blake. That's one thing that we go to as a yeah, group. Yeah, no, I just go to page 34 of Pornhub. Hey, <laughs> hey, you know what? A topical thing. You guys didn't try to get on Pornhub here in uh, Utah? <laughs> Hang on, just to be clear, just to be clear. We've been here five hours. <laughs> What happened? 69, you guys, dudes! You guys didn't try to get on Pornhub? Uh, oh, no. today? No, not yet. Hey, not, not yet. I mean, hey, me, see? me neither, but a friend told me. <laughs> uh, you can't, dude. What? what? You can't get on Pornhub. They don't even know Pornhub like we know Pornhub. What? Wait, Wait, we have to go. I'm so sorry. I'm no. so sorry. We have to We're go. We're so sorry go. for this whole episode. <laughs> Wait, are you... I don't know what are you saying? Yes, so evidently you cannot look at you have to have like age consent. Ugh! Yeah. <laughs> well Yuck. that seems fine. Ah! Yeah, that's, that's okay. You can probably So but then do you that. have to like put your like ID on a porn site to do it. <laughs> no. And so Pornhub just goes, you know what? Peace. We out of here. And they're not in, in Utah. Whoa. Really? <gasps> well, you guys so, are hey, missing Valerie, out. We gotta Valerie, go. We don't know what to tell you. <laughs> yeah. You, Maybe, if, I mean, I if would you're in try, a rut, I will say that like they're probably looking at us like, yeah, it's good because you've been here six hours and already looked. We don't have it and we don't think about it ever. Yeah, but I'm but away because, from my wife for six hours. Yeah, but that's hit also it, because hit it. <laughs> hit yeah. what? That's all. I don't know the Pornhub saying. Oh, I don't sorry. know. Hit it. Yeah. Dirt. Yeah. But do they have? But We're do they the have X hamster? They do. They do. You guys, they do. They you have guys chatter I don't know. A friend told me that they do. <laughs> a friend oh, told cool. me that they do. You got friends in Salt Lake? Too? Yeah. <laughs> yes, I do. And but you had to put in your ID. So do you do that, or do you just think of fun memories from the ninth grade? <laughs> you go no, for bro. Memories. You beat it it's to Instagram. Don't be weird. <laughs> What? I don't know. He said, he said, I don't know. This dude said, I don't know. I feel hey. like Utah, so, your license plate should be like Utah, the land that porno forgot. Yeah. I, that'd be a fun. Yeah, that could be something. So, Valerie, like uh, how do you get out of a creative rut? I would say find something that brings you pleasure. <laughs> yes, I, exactly. I would say just keep doing the thing, the creative thing, whether it's like writing or painting, just keep doing it. Just keep going. Like, don't yeah. stop. Get through the rut. Don't yeah. like go to the beach for the day or whatever the fuck you guys do here. Okay. There ain't no the beach. beach boys just do. sit beach down boys. and grind. I would say abuse substances. Yeah. Okay. That's a fun one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what I like to do is I like to put on music that brings me joy. Blink-182, Green okay. Day. Okay. Tyal Cruz's Dynamite. Okay. Did like you say it's Tyal Cruz? Saying A O, better let go. And then a new dream when you used to our life. Say A O. Shut the fuck up! Yeah. <laughs> God. No. Adam just turned this into like one of those trampoline zones for kids. <laughs> <laughs> Sky high. So Where Nate Nasty wants this. to know Popo's out. Can I get a drop on the soundboard? Hit him with a Oh, blade. yeah, I'll hit you with the Popo's. Popo's out! <laughs> <laughs> cool question. So, N N A N A N C. What? Well, that's that girl. Whatever her name is. Uh huh. I think. Did, did you just? Did you just? N A N A N C. Nancy? No. N A N C. <laughs> oh. N A N C. Is that how you say it? I like to think it's pronounced a Nancy. A Nancy. I think it's a Nessa. Nope. <laughs> yep, you want to give me that. a peek? Let me see it. Did any of anal? <laughs> yeah, you're doing great. Any yeah. any N C J. Anderson, <laughs> Did any of you cry after filming the last episode of Work of Workaholics? And in fact, I think I was crying during the last scene. I think you see me be like, oh. "Well, why didn't you cry about?" Yeah, yeah. No, I mean yeah. that was. I a, was a real bitch about it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Adam cried. Adam cried. None of us cried. I just Adam cried. He's a oh. bitch. No, you yeah. guys all three cried. Oh, huh? You guys all cried. I didn't. I cry. cried. I yeah, did you did. Because I remember I didn't. Yep. I, we know, Durs, you have no emotions. It's but, actually very weird. But when my family got to set, <laughs> maybe I cried. 
<laughs> but we were gonna binary. film. We were like gonna film Game Over Man like in three weeks from that day. Right. Yeah. And so yeah, didn't. But it was cry. an end of an era. And, yeah. Uh, and what you, sucks yeah. is that makes you hey, cry. Fuck Paramount Plus because we don't get to make the movie. Dude. Oh, yeah. Hey, yeah. Shit. hey. Yeah, it can't be good. my idea because maybe they'll uh, take legal precautions. But if we all want to, f- it could be my fuck- idea. Yeah, let's all chant, chant fuck Paramount, fuck Paramount Plus. Plus. Okay, feel free. Fuck. Fuck Paramount Plus. Fuck Paramount Plus. Fuck it. Wow, did you hear that Paramount Plus? That's a lot of weird. people in SLC are pissed. Yeah, how Stacey come you guys? None of you guys said it. I'm the only to one. To be that fair, said it. I've well, said it. they're on they're on tough times. They are falling apart. And, oh uh, yeah, they uh, are. They're it's crumbling. Pretty, it's pretty rewarding to see. <laughs> yep. Fuck them. So Justin Paul, sa- two first names, says Adam plus bumper equals performance. Please don't stop the music. <laughs> bop, 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 bop. Check me out. It's getting late. I'm making my way over to my favorite place. I gotta get my body moving, shake the sweat away. A simple melody. How? If you can't tell, Adam reads these before the show. (laughs) Adam picks the cards. (laughs) Hey, Will A. says, please let the Wizards play today. And guess what? First of all, the Wizards don't play. It's not up to us. Okay? And it is not up to us. I don't know how many times we have to explain this. We don't choose when the portal opens. Did he say let the Wizards play? Dude, Lamal Spellswell would skull fuck me. If I even tried to, like, do any sort of seniority on him. Yeah, no, they have powers beyond your wildest imagination, and they will fuck you up if and you fuck with their portal. And on top of those powers, they might just skull fuck you. Yeah. And that, that's what happens. They Maybe grab your skull and they fuck it. Then they skull fuck, fuck you. It. Yeah. <laughs> Graphic, dude. Well, dude, these are them. Yeah, that's yeah, true. They come from yeah. a different realm. It's actually kind of normal. It's like how yeah, it's in like, Great Britain they say cunt and we just don't say it here because yeah. it's like a little too offensive. Yeah. yeah. Skull fucking where they're from is like it's like shaking, fucking. It's like shaking hands. <laughs> it's like titty fucking. Yeah. It's like birds in the bee shit. So any take backs, any apologies, oh. any epic slams? What are I'm going to apologize to whoever I yelled at over here about like the money. Um, yeah, my bad. Yeah. Say it. And I stand by double keeping, down. keeping the money and shooting rockets with my friends. Oh. Sure. Double down on the yeah. billionaire dream. Yeah. 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 That's it. Yeah. Nice. Um, nice. I'll, I'll double down on that freaking buzz ball I took. It wasn't so bad. I didn't get diarrhea. I'm All hyped. right. We'll have another yeah. one. Not yet. Yeah. I feel Go great. Ahead and have another one. I feel by the great. way, this is when is it take backs and double downs? Uh, we're doubling down on okay. the road. Or dead so ringers. Double. We did a dead ringer. Are but, there you any know, dead also, ringers? Keanu Reeves is another one I get all the time. <laughs> Fat Keanu Reeves. Dang, I want... Wait, when have you ever truly gotten... Yeah. You look I like I feel like Keanu that's Reeves. the one you made up. <laughs> yeah. No. yeah. Yeah, dude. I get Matt Damon and Mark Wahlberg all the time. <laughs> yeah. I definitely... I get Keanu Reeves more than I get Steve Aoki. Uh, not the other day, bitch. Well, the other day at fucking the, the, the Beaver damn. Bar, yeah, I got hit twice with They're the like, cake man. You look like Keanu Reeves when he's wet in the latest John Wick. They do say, they do say, like a little bit bigger. They're like, you look like, they're like, yeah, yeah, much fatter, yeah. much fatter, a right. little bit, a little yeah. bit bigger, right, a little bit. You That's look like big say. Keanu Reeves. <laughs> well, actually, yeah. my you son, look like actually, Bill, actually, you look like Bill ate Ted. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, was he Ted or Bill? It's Fuck. not Bill A. He's Ted, but like you look like Bill Ted. Ate Ted, Ted like is Ted. not a thing. Ted ate you look Bill. like Ted ate Bill. Ted ate Bill. Yeah, I'm over the here. The Matrix fully loaded. <laughs> <laughs> Nacho fries. First of all, I think we've lost yes, somebody boys. here in, in the front row. What do you mean? You oh. good, dude? See, falling asleep. You good? Uh-oh. Yep. yep, yep. Uh, it might be time to wrap up the show. I think okay. someone just. <laughs> Just died right there. <laughs> okay, hell yeah. No take back. He's, he's not enough. You got any, Do we got any epic giveaways? Yeah, get, throw some Do fucking we? shirts oh, out. Oh, we have epic giveaways. Oh, you guys are shit. lucky. I'm going epic deep, guys. Oh. We got epic giveaway. Check out this naked grandma tee. This thing is fucking hot. Yo, this is a size... That's an L. Who wants it? Who wants it? There you go. There you go. 
Yes. Nice toss. Hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. Thank you guys so much. Salt Lake City. Salt Lake City. City. We're we so love glad. you guys. Thank you for showing up. You you Yo, Wait, come you on out. We didn't know what to rock. expect, and you guys blew our expectations out the water. We really appreciate it. You guys it. are the shit. Thank you, brother. Salt Lake City. You woke up. You woke we up, love baby. You. And this you is another up. episode of This, this is, is Important. Thank you so much.